Hey everybody, welcome to Live, Laugh, Love, Tear It. Today's topic is going to be a divine masculine energy read towards divine feminine. So take it how it resonates if it's your story. Divine masculine is the yang energy that is masculine oriented, action oriented, and it goes out and does things, right? For the benefit of, you know, what you're trying to manifest in your life. While the feminine energy, the divine feminine, is that energy of yin, and it attracts. So this is the feminine energy that is not action-oriented, but does indeed manifest, but manifest exactly their own energy. So nine times out of ten, it's anything that has to do with abundance. So look. If you want to book a personal reading with me, if you want to, you know, join my Patreon, buy merch, just support the channels and Oracle decks, any and everything uh, will be available down in the description box only, links, whatever you need. So remember that spirit is past, present, or future. So this could resonate past, present, or future. So take it how it resonates if it's your story. If it's not, check out my playlist. I have multiple collective reads on there. So for starters, divine masculine is wanting to take their time about something when it comes to the, the divine feminine energy. It's something here that's being noticed. You know, I feel like, mm, and the masculine is in this energy of two of wands. What the fuck am I going to do? Am I going to stay single? Nine of Pentacles. Am I going to hold on to my hoes, right? Stuck. And masculine could be um, an earth sign. Could be a Virgo towards Capricorn. Nine of Pentacles. It takes this... Fuck, it's taking this person so long to go within. Two major arcana and then a Knight of Pentacles in the middle. This is like a very long fucking time. Divine Fem, I don't even know if you're even still around. <laughs> We're going to pull that energy next. See, Queen of Wands. But the Divine Masculine sees you. Divine Fem is beautiful, you know, handsome. Could be a male or a female in this energy, okay? Remember, yin and yang. We have both of them within us, okay? But Six of Pentacles is like, can I, can I not? It seems guilty uh, in some instance to have this divine feminine, right? But it's really Wheel of Fortune, your karma, like good karma, okay? Queen of Pentacles. This is a very um, abundant feminine that you're going after, divine masculine. Let's see, what is Divine Feminine's energy towards Divine Masculine? Keys on a ring. Divine Feminine feels like Divine Masculine is treating them as an option, you know? Like the Masculine has many options, you know what I'm saying? What else? And this Feminine wants to come out of separation, you know? Definitely missing this Masculine. Let me get one more. Wow, and this feminine has been the chaser. Shit. The karmic, it's a karmic relationship here. This masculine is still in a karmic relationship. And that's why this masculine is still kind of treating this feminine like an option still. That's basically what's going on. So let's clarify now. The masculine's feelings towards this divine feminine. Let's clarify seven of pentacles. What's going on with this masculine? Okay, so this comes out in reverse sunglasses. Watching, looking, stalking, gaslighting, focusing out. This masculine isn't doing that, though. It's in reverse here. So it's like the masculine is shit. It's like the Grim Reaper in reverse. It's like I'm not really, I'm like ignoring you a little bit. I'm like leaving you on pause just so that you can just, you know, be in limbo like I am until I decide what it is that I want. That's this energy of this masculine towards this feminine. Let me get some clarity for 
This is Two of Wands, Nine of Pentacles. Kisses. See, deep down inside, this masculine loves this divine feminine, unconditional. I don't know. Cupid's arrow is like this masculine has this thing about falling in love, feeling like they're trapped. Yeah, soulmates. They're in this head. They're in their head about are you the one? Shit. And twin flames, and I like you. For a lot of you, you're in a twin flame connection. For some of you, it's like this masculine is thinking you're just a soulmate, but it's like it's so much more than that. It's so deeper than that. On the surface, is I like you, but then underneath that is twin flames. So that's why this situation is so difficult. You know, nobody's talking to each other right now. This masculine is distant, hasn't really been talking to their feminine, but they are reminiscing, thinking about times that you all have spent together. And they want to give you some form of stability. They're wondering if they can give this stability, this masculine to the feminine. Because here we have that very long time taken, the hangman and the hermit, to go within, okay? Stuck on going within, okay? To give this form of stability, that's what the Knight of Pentacles offers, okay? Bottom deck is breakup, okay? Separation, stop the pattern. This masculine is going to end up leaving a karmic situation, but only when they've mustered up enough courage to do so. This masculine feels like they're not enough right now. They're going back and forth in their head, but they can't get you out of their head, Divine Femme. That's the thing. So they just leave you on hold. Hoping that you will stick around. Hoping that you will, things will come to light and things will change and heal some kind of way. Yeah, steadily reminiscing though. Okay, so let's get this masculine's energy going forward. Um, what's this masculine's energy towards their karmic that they're with right now currently? Here we have yes in reverse, and then we have this love scares me in reverse. This is like a type of toxicity that this masculine just phases it out. It's like they just accept it, you know? That's the that's what I'm getting. I need time for me, see? This masculine gives everything to this karmic, to this relationship that they're in. I want to start a family with you. So they have a, a family with this karmic. They have children, some type of ties with this karmic, okay? That's what's going on in the backdrop. What's going on with the divine masculine? What's the divine masculine's energy towards divine feminine? Like, what else do we need to know? Okay. You are so beautiful. Why do you need me? You know, like you're so handsome. That's that not enough energy. Like I'm not good enough energy, right? I just dream or wish for everything. Like I really wish that we could have everything together. But this person is very jealous, okay? This masculine is jealous too, you know? But it's like things, it's like they know that they're doing things with this karmic, so... The thought of you doing those type of things, the fine fam, that they are doing to you with this karmic, it just blow the fuck out of them. Like, it says, I lie away thinking about our future. This masculine knows that they, like, they want to offer stability, but they can't exactly offer this stability just yet. So, they don't even want to think about it. We also have... Now is not the time. So this masculine is steadily putting this divine feminine on hold. But do you think about me too? That's what this masculine wonders. And you are so very special. This masculine definitely still loves this feminine. It feels like this feminine is like their light, okay? That you like heal them and you just make things better. And they also want to <laughs> want to exchange energy with you for sure. Um I think we should see other people. So when this masculine thinks this, they feel guilty, right? One more. And it says, could I be your hero, baby? But in reverse, this masculine just does not think that they have anything to offer you stable. Yeah, words do hurt. It's like they're down on themselves. They talking shit, you know. It's just like a negative type of energy that this masculine has. Let me get one for this masculine's energy. To kind of sum it up, I just wanted to come out. It says untold secrets. So this masculine has a lot of untold secrets here. That they're coming out of some form of addictions. 
they definitely want to follow their own path, okay? This is my Oracle deck. It is available for purchase down below in the description box. Also on my website, www.livelaflove, that's L-O-V, Tara.com. And it's called Clear Vision Oracle Volume 1. I thank you all so much for all of the love, support, tips, and donations to this channel. Um, smash that like button if this reading resonated with you. Smash that like button if you want to see more collective reads, divine feminine, divine masculine reads. Smash that like button. I thank you all so much for all of the love and support. Until then, peace and love.